الفضيل بن عياض said about Abu Hanifa كان حسن الليل كان his, his night was beautiful what does that mean? that's an expression the early generations the Salaf used for someone who would pray for so long at night كان حسن الليل his night was very good that meant, that meant that he would pray a lot a beautiful prayer at night now this is an aspect of Abu Hanifa many people don't know Abu Hanifa prayed the whole night from Isha to Fajr. Most of his life, Abu Hanifa prayed Fajr with the same wudu that he prayed Isha with. Is that clear? The same wudu he had for Isha, he prayed Fajr with the same wudu. What does that mean? He never slept at night. He never slept at night because if he slept, he would lose his wudu and make wudu. So that means he would be awake from Isha to Fajr and during that time, he would pray most of the time. This is why they called him Al-Watad, the pig. Why? Because he was just like a very fixed kind of pole in the ground. If, if he prayed, he didn't move. He didn't move. He was so stable and fixed in his place because of the khushu'. That was Abu Hanifa, rahimahullah. Now another aspect, he would pray all night, not only this, he would read the whole Qur'an every night in his Qiyam. The whole Qur'an. And that's another aspect that many people don't know about Abu Hanifa. Abu Hanifa would recite the whole Qur'an every night. Every night he would finish reciting the Qur'an. So there were actually, in the history of Islam, there were four famous people who used to do this as a regular practice. Only four people who would do this as a regular practice. The first one among them was Uthman ibn Affan. Uthman ibn Affan radiyallahu anhu. The second one was Al-Imam al-Shafi'i. Al-Imam al-Shafi'i rahimahullah. The third one was Abu Hanifa. And the fourth one was another companion. Tamim al-Dari. Tamim al-Dari, the companion, the great companion, Tamim al-Dari. So these four people were known for doing this often, reading the whole Qur'an in Qiyam al-Layl, in Salah, the whole Qur'an in one night. Obviously, a lot of people would ask, how, how could you do this? How could you do this? SubhanAllah, that's a barakah in time. That's a barakah in time. وسعد أطل وسعد أطل